Large herbivores is the exemplary of diet, large muscle mass, those types of things. But you kind of discount that a lot of these herbivores have way different digestive systems and spend most of their day eating vegetation. For example, the lowland gorilla spends about 90% of its day eating different vegetation. Which ones? Leaves. Leaves. Yeah. Right. And fruit and, and other and shoots and any type of vegetation in the jungle. Right. In the lowlands. While trying to have children. So I know what you That's were going to go 10%. to. That's the 10%. I was right. 10% of his time but also is, the, is, is, is literally, puppy. yeah, he's out trying to father and continue the race. Now, I know what you're going to talk about the stomachs, right? Of cow having four stomachs and they having it. Well, we have one and we take bovine fluid, which is not designed for a human body. It's designed for bovine. So when you eat bovine fluid, for you guys that milk. don't know that, called milk, well, cow milk. It doesn't digest. So not only am my black ass not lactose intolerant, <laughs> none of us are to deal with Wait, lactose. Did you say well, no some, ice cream? Uh, not cow ice no, cream. No, but some, I mean, some people do can continue to have uh, lactate, lactose in their, uh, the oh, exact no, no, enzyme to break apart. down lactose. I, no, they don't. Later, yes, they do. No, they call pimples. Their life. Those are called pimples. And so that big white thing that comes on your forehead, that's, milk. that's your body literally trying to no. well, we're, rid we've yourself. Well, totally, we've totally digressed from the actual question. Can, can, can I, can I, can I try to ask a question? I'm, I'm going to run Billy through the translator. So what, I think what Billy's getting at is that he's saying that, yes, certain animals can get big and develop muscle mass, but they spend an amount of their day eating these things that we as humans, we don't have 90% of our day to sit around eating leaves. It's an inefficient... Most of plant matter is made up of cellulose, which is made from cell walls when we are made up of cell membranes and we can't consume those. Okay, so I got a question. Within the cell, right? Mm -hmm. it, w within the mitochondria, how do you clean that? Well, if you eat things that are blocking your body, you literally are slowing down the fan and you're slowing down your cell production. And if we're, if we're talking on a cellular level, when you're speaking on a cellular level, you should only eat things, cells that can go in your mouth, give you fuel, and be removed. When you're eating dead carcass, your body now, when you goes into your stomach, recognizes it as flesh, throws an enzyme around it, and says, hey, you're eating yourself or you're eating of yourself when it only recognizes cells. I forgot to tell you too, I'm, I'm almost a doctor. But right. besides that. <laughs> no, but quick question about that. When it takes to, uh, so you're talking about like high cholesterol and a lot of the oils that go in? That comes out of the food that you're eating. Right. We're not supposed to eat the cholesterol. When you eat eggs, that's 100% cholesterol. And that's bad uh, LDL. You don't want to eat that. So if you're eating 100% cholesterol in your body, you are now slowing down your blood content. You're adding so much blockage within your veins and you're causing your heart to beat hard. But doesn't that have more to do with insulin sensitivity, which has to do with muscle mass rather than actual cholesterol levels? No. So in when you're taking these cholesterol, most of, I mean, most of your insulin comes from your liver. So if you're blocking your liver, you now put all the, pro all the, all the uh, problem or all the the added onto your pancreas, which doesn't make anywhere close to the insulin as your, as your liver does. So if you don't eat things that block your liver, you now will not become diabetic or have this insulin problem. Now back to keep, <laughs> no, but seriously, to keep your insulin. I feel like that ref from the yeah, box. No, but yeah, keeping no, your insulin levels, I mean, your insulin sensitivity, a lot of that is affected by high sugars, seed oils, and a lot of the stuff that you end up consuming as a vegetarian because you try to fill your hunger levels and try to eat stuff that is vegan or vegetarians. And this is a lot of fruit sugars, you know, uh, fructose, sucrose, just because you're searching to get energy from things that will give you energy and end up ruining your insulin sensitivity, lowering your muscle mass, and just wow. all those benefits that okay. you look for hold, through hold the point. vegetarian Great. diet. Okay. This, is, this is one way of looking at it, but this is the true way of looking at it. Your body does not want fructose. Your body wants glucose. Where glucose, that is what is helping the mitochondria of your cell, glucose. But when you eat a Western diet, they're forcing sugar, which is fructose, into your diet. When you eat a hamburger, all that sugar inside the bread, all the sugar inside of ketchup, all the sugar inside of uh, inside of uh, mustard. When you eat, because your body's designed as a as as a herbivore to only. I I, did, I do not believe that humans were originally herbivores. No. <laughs> Chim chimpanzees, oh, now we've got chimpanzees the are probably closest living ancestor eat other monkeys they eat meat it is well documented i think we are 
actually omnivorous and that was what created the uh, extra. But did we descend from chimpanzees? Or no, did we, we, descend we have a from common a, a ancestor. I, I, I got to answer. I'm we sorry to get an ancestor. That was documented ability, to but that's eating just meat. A, no. that's eating meat is one of the stat. reasons why our brains grew when other animals didn't. Listen, and I'm going to tell you something. If we came from, like, remember that guy said, if we're descended from apes, why are there still apes? Because we're not descended from current apes. We're descended from a common ancestor. Okay, so this is going to get into a deeper thing, and I want people to do the research. This is not me saying it. This is research, okay? <laughs> Sneakerella, Disney Plus. Black <clears throat> people have been on the planet for 16 years, 16,000 years. They say the Caucasian has only been on the planet for 6,000 years. We're gentrifying. <laughs> right? <laughs> then they came in and took over Brooklyn. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right? So if, if, if that is a true statement, right? I, I got part of this from Dr. Ben Carson. I'm not saying that, but he knows, and, and Dr. Clark. And so when we talk about humans and how the humans are designed, Certain people are designed a certain way. Caucasians come from the Caucasus Mountains, supposedly. Now, when I went to Egypt, and I studied, and I just to let you know, I'm just I'm just going over. So different digestive going to it. Being you have light hair, light color skin, light eyes, obviously a, a cave dweller, <laughs> and it's because <laughs> because you had to come from you couldn't deal with the sun. Your 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 hair was elongated. Your nose was elongated because it was cold to air. Am I correct? This is, I've yeah. Billy right. tapped out. Oh, no. Billy tapped. You got it. Oh, oh my god. god. I've never I mean, seen Billy you got right it. hair I'm, hair I'm on not. your body. Why yeah. have you seen yeah. Africans? There's no hair on our body on our chest. Real. So it's a different. It's a different situation, and when you when when you're in cold weather and you have to eat what's available, is when they grabbed animals. The first thing they did in Africa, if you did it, they did it in Japan too. When they would eat a fish, that's why sushi. They would have a whole fish and have small amounts of it. But when you eat something that boom that shuts your body down, where you have to go to sleep, it's not just black people got negroitis or uh, you know what I'm saying. White folks eat and get sleepy too, and they rubbed it because your body trying to digest something that is not supposed to be in it. It's not giving it fuel. It shuts you down, make you go to sleep because the body is cleaning and digesting while you rest. I mean, this all makes sense to me because every time I eat a big meal, I want to go to sleep. Right, and you're lazy. You don't want to walk. Yeah, that's true. Also, <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, yeah. That's, that's, I mean, uh, Let's, guilty, guilty. Let's I, distill this debate down to something that everyone can understand. What is the greatest food of all time? Oh, the ones that uh, the the best thing about we call fast food fruit in the vegan world. Oh, that's right? so lame. <laughs> yeah, if you grab it, and eating too much fructose. I got excited for it's not yeah. glucose. It is glucose. Uh, no, so, fru the, the when you're okay, eating fruit, the definition it's, of fruit. It's a pear. Okay. fructose is sugar from fruit. Okay, but this is sugar that your body identifies. The other sugar is literally like a residue of salt. Like when you get table salt, that's a residue of sea salt. If you take sea salt, and I tell people those all the time, I uh, I literally would tell you to take a, a half a teaspoon of Celtic sea salt and put it in your mouth and literally swish it around for five minutes. Then spit that out. And the reason I tell you that is now you have all the minerals that you need from the salt. And every time you eat, you will not have a taste. You will not say, hey, this needs salt. It won't happen. And if you eat the fruit, right, you eat fruit that has um, the citrus fruit. Certain times you eat a citrus fruit. I think you should eat bananas every day, especially man, it's good for your thing. And I also think that you should eat fruit and vegetables according to seasons that they grow. Because that's how your body is going to move according to the sun and the moon. So are you saying banana is the greatest fruit of all time? The greatest fruit of all time is passion fruit to me. I love passion fruit. But but you understand that corn syrup is fructose. Corn syrup is made, is a derivative of what they make in a factory. Anything made in a right. factory is factory made and that's not it. But right. anything made in nature organically not the ones not the watermelons without seeds not all the, not the gmo situation you you can eat it look you you can't tell me that because i watch you same boat run backwards faster than most people run forward he's a fruit eating uh gazelle is he a vegan uh, no he should be because he's jamaican they eat oxtail and they eat ox dick but most of the time they eating uh they eating um Plain green thing. And they're eating, uh, uh, like, even rosters, right? Rosters don't eat anything that you can't catch in your hand. So if a fish, you catch it in your hand, you could eat it. So do you, so I don't preach, like, when you said talking about cheeseburgers and stuff, I don't think that's healthy. Really doesn't I think preach high that. protein, like, high meat diets. What's high protein? 
just you know the key I, the I'm keto diet macros. has been proven to cause heart attack. Right, I'm saying yeah, low he had us on it, and we all we all almost got had fucking, a heart attack. Yeah, yeah, no, no we but were, that depends on your we kidney stones. stones. Everyone in this room has kidney stones. Yeah, thanks to because Billy. of Billy. Yeah. Okay, so how we get rid of kidney stones? This is what I want you guys to do. I, I want piss. you to drink a liter of water, spring water a day, and I want you to put a teaspoon of baking soda in it. And throughout the day, I want you to drink that. That is going to help your kidneys, give all the nutrients it want, and we can hopefully eventually push the stones through your body without having to have pain. Okay. Well, uh, what, are you, you got more? My last point. Okay. Yeah, I feel you're yeah, a, you're yeah. a tap. Dude, we're, we're, I don't tap. I mean, we started like talking a, about like it. This is like a okay. UFC fighter that's been submitted. They're, they're raising <laughs> yeah, the other guy's hand, yeah, and like, then no, Billy's no, finally wanna, waking up. He's yeah, like, I, I want need the tap. rematch. I want rematch. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. But Billy, how old are you? I'm 23. Oh, yeah, I have children. A sneaker's older than you. <laughs> but that doesn't mean anything. I'm glad you're at this point, but I want you to look and I want you to pay attention to literally what you eat should be should go in, give you energy, and go out. And when you eat when you eat dead carcass, your body is slowly to move that through your body and it dehydrates you, which makes it even slower to move through your how, body. How about what this? if I'm a John Sally... as a carcass eater? Um, then your teeth would be sharper. And you would eat it raw. If you really, really want to prove that you should eat meat, you should never cook it. Oh, oh he already doesn't. Liver? Yeah. Well, if you, what you're going to do is get really sick because you, it's decaying caucus. So the only way they can get around it is to change the DNA by cooking it more than 118 degrees. I, I just think that eating a healthy diet with meat, low carb, um, you know, without like all these processed stuff, seed oils, processed sugars. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying meat isn't really the devil. It's it is. more the no, process. No, the people that kill sentinel beings thinking that I deserve and I'm above them, nothing deserves to die. Let me just say this one thing to you. I'm going to get this to you. If, if Remember I Am Legend with Will Smith, great yeah. movie, and yeah, I yeah. Am Legend 2 is coming out. I don't want to advertise that oh, movie because Sneakerella 2 yes. Sneakerella that, is, yeah. is coming out May 13th on Disney+. Plus. Make sure you check your uh, listings. This is the deal on the 13th. If you had to hunt your food, you'd be a vegetarian. Guaranteed, because you would not be able, one, you wouldn't have a refrigerator. <laughs> Two, if you killed the big old something, you would have to hurry up and get it before the real predators came and decided that you were gonna be a side meal. And if it got to it, and one thing, you can't always go and get a kill, you're gonna have to eat something. And there was, well, I eat beef jerky. I'm really not well. saying oh, not right. eat vegetation. Right. But pretty soon, that was all you'd be able to eat. I, I'm, I'm, all I'm going to say is I'm going to end this here. Wait, 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 wait one, one more thing, one more thing. John this Sally is, definitely has done a lot of research. One, yeah, I got out of your research. This is all I did. Research, one more thing, one more thing. I wasn't going to get into ge like genetic diets. Yeah, don't worry about it. Just <laughs> let me, let me give you this, gonna, let me give you this one those. thing I want you to think of. So at one time, um, uh, black folks were brought to this country and were enslaved. They did not give them meat. And look how strong they were. There was no meat. There was, they wasn't giving no slaves no steak. They wasn't giving them no chicken. You better not kill that chicken. They were eating vegetables. And look how strong they were. There's tap. no chance Billy's going to have tap, anything to say. Right. Tap, yeah, yeah, tapping yeah. Out. So how, about, how, about, how about this, though? How about if you can accurately predict who the, who the NBA Finals MVP will be right Tatum. now? Tatum. Yeah. Oh. Then Billy has to go vegan for a month and try it. I, I put it to this way. If you go, if you do it, my source of vegan. If if we can have a conversation and you don't lie, I, right? Because you'd be lying to yourself. If you, I, I, mean, I told Madison too. Madison thinks I'm crazy on the stuff I'm I'm trying to push in, but I'm I'm sure if you because it's, I did it the wrong way too. I was a junk food vegan, and I was a processed food vegan, and it's not the way to be. I would give you things that they're not mentioning to you. Um, digestive enzymes, uh, systemic enzymes. I would make sure you took a certain amount of herbs. Uh, uh, you're 23 years old. I, I would give you the right amount of herbs, especially ones that clean out your low intestines. And I guarantee you, your cut of your body after dealing with me and your workout, I guarantee you're going to be like, yeah, and you're not, because I'm going to give you a fake cheat day, meaning you get a processed food day just not a dead animal processed food day. Okay, so Billy, All if right. it's Jason Tatum, NBA Finals MVP, yeah. you have to go vegan for I'll a month. I'll do it with you. His can, way. Can I still drink Coors Light? Is Coors Light vegan? Yes. 
All right, okay. there we go. Cause Perfect. Perfect. will I get strength gains? Yes. Yes. I will You're gonna go be able to do, said that. And, and you should do more static workout than, than doing lift. Your body will never push a weight. So the more static and the more flexibility you get, the stronger you become. Will I be able to bench press more than I can? He only, How benches, much your he only benches 255. 275. That's Same a as lie. me. That is oh, a lie. I look know a girl that can do that. No, look behind you. <laughs> 275. That's, that's, my, that's I'm on your top handwriting of as well. Wow, I guarantee you, you how much you want? I, I, how about I, I get 30 pounds over, on top of it? I benched over 300 pounds before, but that's what it is now. Nobody was there, so we don't believe you. Yep. It was in college. We can <laughs> check my, yeah. we can check my, we can check my football coach. Yep. My football yep. coach has a record. Uh -huh. of yeah, 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 yeah. He also had needles in the back room. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 